Hello, welcome back to my channel. Well, we've got our first media report out and the title says Freely Geordie's Defence Lack Defective. Ooh. Yes, that's the stand the media is going to take. So let's have a look at what they write. Okay, so it says here, uh, late and defective court papers filed by the entertainer Friendly Geordies fail to explain why accusing a senior politician of perjury is justified, a court has been told. Jordan Shanks, Mark Ivona, is being sued for defamation in the federal court over two videos viewed by more than a million times, viewed more than a million times on YouTube about New South Wales Deputy Premier John Barillaro. We are making a wholesale attack on the defence, Barrister Sue Chrysanthu. SC for Barillaro told the court on Friday, there's barely a paragraph that will survive given the lack of particulars. Mr Barillaro says the entertainer, known by the Monica Friendly Geordies, unduly defamed him and subjected him to a vile and racist attack in YouTube videos published in September and October 2020. In one video, the entertainer refers to Barillaro as a big, fat, wog, beep, Grease in their Kelly and a con man to the core powered by spaghetti. The New South Wales leader, who is of Italian heritage, says the first video titled Bruz insinuated that he was a corrupt con man and had conducted himself in committing perjury nine times that he should be jailed. Um, that's not how you spell jailed, by the way, either. The entertainer admits Bruz carried those meanings in a wider defence, pleading contextual truth and justification, the court was told but he wants part of the MP's claim struck out as they concern truth or otherwise the comments made before the New, West, New South Wales Parliament. Had he pleaded the particulars, we would have been with the argument that those particulars infringe parliamentary privilege. Barrister Matthew Collins QC for Shanks Mark Kavina has told the court. Mr Collins considered the defence was filed and said three days late but said it caused no prejudice to Mr Barillaro. The parties were in correspondence and the proper way forward was to have Mr Barillaro request from the New South Wales Lower House waive parliamentary privilege over his comments, he said. But Mr Chris Anthony, describing the defence as defective on its face, said the case law was clear, full particulars first, questions privilege second. Our issue is they're not telling us the case against our client, the, defam the defamation specialist said. He's accusing a member of the Crown of nine counts of perjury with not one particular. Mr Barillaro has also objected to the late service of the defence requiring Shanks Markovina to apply for court permission to admit it. The hearing on July 23 will also concern the entertainers want to strike out parts of the MP claim. Shanks Markovina's application for a jury to determine defamation claims will be heard at a later date. Jury trials are the exception to judge alone trials in the federal court. Google is also being sued as the publisher of YouTube. Mr. Barillaro is seeking judicial permission to serve the tech giant overseas. So what do you reckon? As I said, we've already got it. i just f interested to see that, um, um, you know, Cassanthu is a defamation specialist. Cassanthu is a defamation specialist and, uh, you know, very interesting how the, it's they change the wording in that. Um, because don't where are we? How did they refer to oh, Mr. Collins? <laughs> Mr. Collins, uh, he's actually Dr. Collins, by the way. But anyway, let's let's not let's not fight, let's not, um, in, you know, let the truth get in the way of our really good story. So, yes, the so the media's already started. So, tell me what you think. Um, Tell me what you think about that article. I'm now certain that this is going to be playing around and around and around. Yes, there were some issues with the with it all, but it's all going to be sorted out on July 23. So tell me what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the like button. Subscribe so you, you can keep 